Ah ja. Ah, je wilt net even kist. Nee, dat is dat mooi. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd just like to thank you again for attending my dinner party and make a toast to a wonderful evening surrounded by friends and good company. Cheers. 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 Ah, uh, nobody panic, it's just a power. No. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have a real murder on our hands. Uh, he told me about uh, your fling a few months ago, uh, and how he has uh, ig been ignoring you since, uh, pretending it didn't happen, out of spite. What does that have anything to do with it? He was my brother-in-law and I wouldn't hurt him. He was uh, opposed to your marriage to the colonel, yes? <laughs> uh, well, maybe if you couldn't have him, then... Uh, Who put you in charge? You're not a law and I don't need to tell you any of this. Just leave me out of this. The police are going to be here soon. One minute. I still need to talk to you. Okay. I uh, understand uh, Mr. Black owed you a lot of money. Is that why you were here tonight? Why are you bringing me into this equation? I've done nothing wrong, I'll have you know. Like I said, uh, she was indebted to you uh, by quite a lot. And why are you bringing that into this investigation? Surely it can't be that important? I uh, think I know more than you think. Uh, as a close friend to the recently deceased, uh, he did indeed uh, confide in me the other night. So, um, can I explain what's happening? Because Miss Peacock is... Sobbing, I guess, would be a good word for it out there. I'm the shortest, that's a over here. There are four. Yeah, Emily. Oh, God. Uh, now, hang on a minute. Gosh, I'm gonna come here tonight. I don't think his quarter million debt to me is that important to this investigation. If you think I'm involved in this, you are sorely mistaken. The mum's an atrocious gambler. He always tried to put me back, otherwise he always tried to get out of it. But I would never go after someone that owed me money, because that's just bad business. This has uh, been quite the bloody business, hasn't it? Tonight we have uh, participated in someone's twisted game of death and deception. The entire thing uh, orchestrated to deceive us on what truly really happened this night. Miss Scarlett. Uh, you invited her tonight because Mr. Black told you he was finally going to pay off his debts to you. Yes. No. You were invited here for a single purpose. She intended to kill you. What? That is a baseless fucking lie. The fuck are you saying? Uh, I'm afraid it's true, Colonel. Yeah. I, uh... I found this file of a uh, crystallized cyanide on Mr. Black's possessions. Uh, most likely he was poisoned before the blackout. Uh, it seemed that his plan was to poison uh, Miss Scarlet and wipe away his debts. What the fuck are you saying, Plum? Uh, the victim had this all planned out uh, in advance. We were all uh, part of his alibi to prove that he did not do it, that he did not poison the wine. And in fact, the wine itself was not poisoned. The uh, glass was. He planned to switch them 
after staging the power cut to avoid suspicion. But uh, that is why he uh, had to die. Isn't that right, Mrs. Peacock? Are you, you mad? I didn't, I didn't kill him. Uh, yes, you did. Uh, you killed him because uh, you were pregnant with his child. What? It is true, Colonel. Uh, she knew the truth when she uh, told you. She was only interested in you for your money. I found this early tonight on Mr. Black's corpse. It's a love letter addressed to him from Miss Peacock. This proves nothing. Certainly not that I'm pregnant. Would you like another glass of wine, Miss Peacock? What? Your wine glass is uh, empty, but there are no lip marks around the trim. In fact, uh, you haven't been drinking all evening. You've been tipping away your drinks. In time, uh, you could claim at least part of uh, his wealth for your child. In this way, he would be uh, more useful to you dead than alive. The only thing he ever did in his miserable life was cause everybody else misery. He's better off dead than he ever was alive. Is it bad that I feel kind of grateful for what she did? Yeah, she did save your life. Uh, she may not have meant to or even known, but she knew someone at the party was going to be poisoned, maybe her. Perhaps she figured this was the only way to defend herself. You really think so? No, but if she has a smart lawyer, that's what her defense would be.